When you're hungry, mm -hmm. you work, okay, but you wake up food, it's all it's beautiful it's cooking. Hey, what's up you dirty freaks and how the hell do you sleep at night? It's Cody, the big boy bad bad guy back in town and I'm back in the Comedy Central test kitchen, the testicles where it all gets going down. You guys know how this works? I'm gonna go around the office trying to find the ingredients to make what I'm gonna be making for myself to be eating. Now, I've been sick with the flu, some call it the gunk machine, but that's what I call my wife. Um, but anyways, I've been sick as a dog, it's cold as crap out now, and what I need is something that's gonna heal me, make me feel good. So right now, it's, oh fuck, fuck the meeting, fuck, fuck, fuck. It's over. It's over. Thank you. Good. Good. Um, actually, Jordan, you know what? Why don't you just stick that around and I'll make sure of it. Stick it around. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, make sure, just stick it around and I'll make sure of it. All right. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Have right. a good. Yeah. Take care. Yeah. You too. What the fuck do we have here? <laughs> okay, we got wings. That looks pretty good. All right. Crudite. Got some chips and salsa. Whatever the hell this is. Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this stuff back to my desk and try to figure out something we can make from it. Okay, I got this bunch of fucking shit here. Welcome to the elevator. Let's go back down to the frickin' testicle. Since we are in the elevator, let's get back to our segment, Tasting for Tough. Fine. Okay, well, it's awesome that we got all these ingredients. I'm so stoked. Um, not so good that I missed my meeting. I'm kind of on a no more strikes rule at work here because you know, I haven't really been, I guess, performing the way they want me to. And that's also a bummer because I told Jessica that there's no way I was losing another job. So they can't really afford to do that. But here we are. Let's take a look at what we got here. Bam! Crudite plate. Nobody says, nothing says crudite more than vegetables on a plate. So here we got some fucked up tomatoes. Made them small. Ants on a log. Fuel. You put ants on here, that's how you, got, that's how you get a log. Come on, root. The crunchy boys are in down. Baby's worst nightmare. Not gonna Then we got wings here. These wings look all right. We got chips and salsa. I mean, you're probably thinking, why is he eating? He's supposed to be making food, but even a bad boy needs snacks. And even a bad boy, even a bad boy, no, no, not a bad boy's good dinner, so. We got some sky end up. Now, what the hell can we do with all this? None of us is screaming fuel. It's freaking cold. It's all goddamn hail outside, so I'm trying to get some freaking warmth inside my body. Oh, what if we freaking, yeah. What if we tried to make a freaking soup, dude? Nothing says cold, warm weather, weather more like a soup. So yeah, we could try to freaking make a chicken stock or something out of these bad boys. And these are two parts of a freaking mirepaw here. We got freaking ants on along, crunchy boys. We're just missing the freaking um, the onions, but this has some fucking onions in it, doesn't it? They're green onions, which you know we probably wouldn't normally use as that, but I wonder if we could get the onions out of here and get rid of that fucking disgusting ass smush that it's in. Um, and then we have some other vegetables. You know what? I think I'm gonna try to make some soup. And you don't have a choice, you're coming with me. So, um, what are we gonna do first? Okay, let's grab some vegetables here. First step in making any soup is to saute your vegetables. Well, most soups. So, let's get rid of the other shit we don't need. And let's get set up and make our vegetables to get a mirepoix. And the carrots get topped up, keeping good. And the junior gets chopped all right. And the celery too got chopped all right. Carrots and celery are done. Okay, here we are in the kitchen. Now, what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to get the onions out of this gross little ranch dip. Um, <clears throat> so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to make a little colander and maybe just give it up. That's loud. Fuck. Seems dangerous a little bit, but we'll see. Uh, oh shit. Uh, uh, fuck. Okay, let's see if that's enough. Let's get the little bad boys in there. This is kind of fucking gross. Just gonna add some more holes. Oh, whoops, fuck. I'm gonna try putting the lid on it. <clears throat> we might be in the lid stage. All right, there we go. That's some relatively green green onions. Boom, bam, boom. Now, we're gonna save a little bit of our vegetable here. 
um, to use later in the soup. So take a handful of those out. Great, saving some of the veggies for later. Some of these green onions back in this bad boy. All right, boom, boom, boom. Save the rest for later. We've got our mirepoix here, onions, carrots, and celery. Um, basically, we need to find some sort of fat. So what we're gonna do is, I think we're gonna try to sizzle this off in the microwave here. Um, usually, of course, I would do this not in the microwave. I mean, dear God, what do you think I am? But we don't have a whole lot of options here, am I right? Um, yes, Cody, you're right, you're always right. Thanks, guys. Um, so, I just found this guy, some classic salad dressing here. I think what we're gonna do is try to harvest this oil um, to use as this sort of fatty lubricant, which is my nickname in high school, um, for these vegetables. Looks like it's working. All right, don't wanna get any of that shit. I think that might work for us. All right, let's try to put these little bad boys where the sun don't shine and see what we got. Get it a beep. Two minutes. Hear those guys sizzling away in there. How's it going, Nick? Making some tea. He's <laughs> making some tea. Wish he had, he probably, probably wishing he had some soup. Ain't that right, Nick? Yeah, he wishes he had soup. All right, let's take a look at our vegetables. Oh my God, fellas, they are sizzling their goddamn asses off here. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. Now that's what I call the base of a goddamn soup if I've ever seen one. Let's go back to the disc and see what else we can do here. Um, what I think we wanna do is I think we should make a chicken stock because just vegetables and water is not gonna be super fun for daddy. We're gonna strip the meat from these bones, um, save the meat for the soup, um, and try to use the bones to make some sort of like stock with the vegetables that we just put in the fridge, um, in the microwave. When you're home, you work, but you wake up food, it's office cooking. Okay, we've taken the meat off of our bonies here, and now we got bonies and a little mirepoix that we sauteed. Let's fill this guy up with water. So we're just gonna have to cook this shit and try to get the flavor out of the little bonies and the vegetables into the soup. Clump open the chompula. Okay, it's in there for 10 and a half minutes. I'm gonna stand by to make sure nothing terrible happens to it. Well, maybe I'll just leave it alone for a second. It's not gonna do anything in a couple minutes here. How's everyone doing out there? Nah, you can't respond, can you? You're just watching. Watch Nick eat a banana, no problem there. <laughs> Suckers, eating a banana when they could be having a whole feast. So, we also have chips and salsa. Chips and salsa. Could try to make tortilla soup. Yeah, that could work. Okay, I just asked my coworkers if it's bad to microwave something for this long, and they said yeah, so let's take a little check on it. It's bubbling. Tastes like not a whole lot. Let's keep going. All right, we got one minute left. I guess that means, I forget, it's been like nine minutes. Let's see what's up. Something's going on. Let's see if we can't find ourselves a spoon. Um, I can't find a spoon, but I did just see these guys here. I'm sorry. Let's go in for it. Oh, shit. Um, well, that makes sense, and now there's a little bit of melted plastic in there, but so it goes. I guess it's screaming hot. Fucking shit. That's not good. Don't include that in the edit. I'm editing this, and it'll probably make it in. Whoops. Okay, time to find a metal spoon. Ahaha. Uh, Jordan's got a spoon. No problem. Spoon time. It looks like a broth, huh? Not so terribly bad, honestly. Obviously needs salt. Bingo. Pepper, salt. Okay, cool. Hey. Mmm. That's pretty good. I would fucking drink that like that. So, I'm gonna add in a little bit more water. We're gonna give it a little bit more time and let it continue to kind of like fucking absorb. Oh, it's so fucking hot. Don't put this in there, of course. Okay, well, while that is continuing to cook, let's see if we can find some lime flavor to put in here, because we can't make freaking tortilla soup without some lime. So, let's see what we got. Bum, 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 bum. This person always has fruit and fucking turkey and shit, so fucking sad, but what are you gonna do? What is this? Uh-oh, jingle jangaroo. Freaking limeade from on high. Hopefully it's not too sweet. It's really sour. It's like lime water for some reason. Maybe someone's on that diet where you just fucking drink a bunch of liquid. That's perfect, that'll be our lemon. Fuck yeah. Oh, not so bad, huh? It looks like we're to sign times where fucking finally, things are finally coming around for old Cody. So that's not so bad. I'm getting kind of impatient, so I think it's time to fucking pull the trigger on this. Time to try to strain this guy. Fuck. I think this is clean enough for our purposes. We got a little bit of chunkies in there, but no problem. Add a little bit more water, boop just to get a little volume up. 
That's good. It can take more water. Okay. Put a little bit of this salsa in there. That fucking tastes like tortilla soup. Let's add in the rest of our shit here. But you wake up food, it's all So now we're basically just gonna cook these vegetables. We're gonna put it in here for maybe three or four minutes. We'll see. All right, let's go find some hot sauce. Well, let's go ask our old friend over here. Hey, do you know anyone that might have hot sauce or hot anything sauce? spicy? Yeah. I got some BBQ sauce here. BBQ, is it spicy at all? Unopened. Well. Can't verify. Unverifiable. Didn't you say one time you had like Mexican candy in here? Yeah. Maybe that's some spicy candy would help. Oop, you know, that's probably um, sweet. You think it's, oh, it's hot. Oh, it might have, it might have some chili on it. Interesting. Sweet, so I got a spicy little mango pop and I got a little freaking tamarind spicy thing. Thank you, dude. You're welcome, man. Hell yeah, okay, cool. Let's see how cooked our vegetables are here. Right in there. Now it needs a lot more salt. There, salt. Put that in there, hit it with a splash of lemon. Mm. Ooh, that helps. Okay, we're almost stupid and we forgot our fucking cubed vegetables. So dumb. Come on, Cody. All right, I got a little stack here. Remember, our carrots and our fucking celery, no problem. Mix those guys in. Not so bad, starting to look like a soup. Why don't we hit it with some mango right now, huh? Give it another three minutes. Okay, ring, ring, ring. Well, that looks like a soup to me, honestly. Let's see. That's pretty good. I think I'm gonna put a little bit more salt. Put a little bit more lime juice here. And now it's time to put in the chicken. Well, maybe not all of it. That's looking pretty good, I think. That looks like a soup. My God. A little bit more salsa. Mm-hmm. Now, I wish this was a little bit spicier, but it is not bad. So let's bring it back to my desk. Okay. So, I think we did a pretty good job here. Oh my god, what is this? I see someone's desk here. But, what the fuck is that, dude? Oh, hot pepper sauce, no problem. All right, nice. That's what I'm fucking talking about, dude. Damn, that's the one thing we needed, and that's the thing that came through. Also, spoons for next time. Pick all this shit up. Okay. All right, let's finish this bad boy off. We've got our soup here, looking just kind of freaking beautiful. We got our chips. Not so bad. Take some of our extra chicken here. All right, and some of our green onions. Delicious. Baby, if you ain't free. All right, there we go. Hello, cruel world. We're back at the desk and look at this beautiful fucking tortilla soup we made all at the office. Um, but enough of my gab jabber and get me out of the fucking video you're probably thinking to yourself, but not yet, because I got to take a dunk right down memory lane. All right, got to get tortilla chips, and chicken, vegetables. Mmm. Are you fucking joking around with me, dude? Is this a fucking... Where's Adam Kutcher, dude? Where's Adam Kutcher? That's fucking dank, dude. Mmm. It's spicy. It's tomato -y. It's a rich... Well, I hope you've seen today there's no limits to your creativity as long as your imagination's driving the train. If you're at an office, there's tons of stuff you can do beyond what the means of what you've imagined originally happened to yourself. So... Don't be afraid to take risks. Don't be afraid to try something new. And remember, a microwave's the only friend you have. See you guys in bed.